guys welcome to my youtube channel this is your girl seraphine uh today's video is all about get to know me tag so as you all know um i'll be answering some questions up here so you guys can get to know me better so you guys can get to know me with this journey of my youtube this is my first youtube channel so i'm gonna be asking myself some questions and i'm answering them so you guys can know me the first question is what's your full name okay my name is seraphine kikoko and my name is angel like yeah i love that name so the second question is are you married i am married with two kids they're all girls and if you guys want to meet them in the future please comment subscribe and i'll put them um on my channel one day and you guys can get to meet them my third question is what's your favorite food oh guys like seriously i do not have a favorite food because i'm too picky when it comes to food so i eat anything that looks good like anything that looks good and it doesn't matter like how you cook it if it looks bad i do not eat it and next question is where are you from Oof, guys i am from africa i am from congo yeah i was i'm from congo that's where i am from yeah i'm not american so my next question is where did you grow up where did where were you born well i was born in congo like i said i'm from congo but i grew up in namibia so yeah that's where i grew up my next question is why did you open a youtube channel well guys it's a long story like i've been wanting to open a youtube channel like since long time but you know i'm a very shy person i was like i'm not gonna be able to focus on the camera and all that but uh my husband kept on pushing like you can do it you can do it you can do it because i felt like i have a lot of things to talk about especially when it comes to girls women teenagers that's that's more reason why i open my youtube channel so i can be talking to young people women relationship a little bit of more like lifestyle with my, my with my family but i can't promise if i'm gonna be doing that but if you all wanna know or you wanna me to be doing like my lifestyle comment down below subscribe and share and i that way i will know like you guys want to know about me more like my lifestyle with my family what's your favorite drink water yeah water is my favorite drink and it's good for your health though so yeah i love water but sometimes tea because i got so addicted to tea because my husband he loves tea so much as you all can see all is with it. it's called in here guys so yeah water tea that's my favorite drink i don't take alcohol or anything like that so water and tea, and tea sorry so let me see next question let me see can you dance i can try when i was little i used to dance a lot but then when i grew up i really can't dance it all went out of me i don't know why but i can try What's your favorite color? Well, I do not have a favorite color. I wear any color. Like when it comes to my clothes, I wear anything that looks good on me. Like any color like that looks good on me. That's all I wear. So I do not have a favorite color. But I hate yellow though. Mm -mm. I do not like yellow color. Like, especially when it's strong yellow, I do not like it. But I don't have preference when it comes to colors. Next question. Between your two parents, who are you close to? Like all of them. Like me and my parents, we can talk about anything. Like I don't fear. It doesn't matter what problem I have. I'll share it with my mom, either my mom, my dad, my siblings too. So they're all my parents, and they're all my best friends, guys. Let's see. Do you believe in love at first sight? <laughs> yes i do it happened guys yeah i do so i'm not gonna explain that because like i said my video is about relationship and all that so maybe on my next video i'll be trying to explain all that but yeah i do believe in love first side so 
the next question is how did you and your husband meet well i promise guys i'm gonna upload a video about that so that way i can be talking while my husband is beside me so i'm gonna be telling you a story how we met it's gonna be so interesting because it of course it is interesting how my husband and i met when did you get married 2017 how long have you been married i've been married for two and a half years with two kids of course i've been popping those kids out guys <laughs> all right next question is do you forgive easily of course i do i do forgive easily and i forget like i'm not such a person who, who forgive and then keep in, things inside me once i forgive i let everything go so and it doesn't take me time to forgive it doesn't matter how angry i was or what but i just let it go i don't let small things stress me or you know all that so i just let it go yeah next question is what do you hate about yourself guys i don't want to talk about it but let me tell you all so, what i hate about myself is spending god i can spend it doesn't matter how much i have in my account like i spend a lot a lot it doesn't matter i need shoes or not i have it or not i'm just gonna go ahead and spend the money so i am i heard that about myself and it's a bad habit i don't know how i'm gonna go over it but yeah it's really really bad habit what makes you happy <laughs> shopping of course shopping makes me happy my family being around my family being around my sisters you know so it makes me really happy yeah so next question is are you a morning person no i'm not i'm not a morning person i'm not the evening person so i'm a very bad person i, I sleep a lot and I, I hate waking up in the morning getting ready to go to work and all that but i have to get used to it though but that's not my thing i only do it because i have to do it i have no choice anyway so yeah so next question what time do you usually get up in the morning 6 a.m so i wake up at 6 a.m in the morning get ready drop my sister school because i live with my baby sister so drop it off and go to work so what's the first thing you do when you open your eyes in the morning <laughs> look at myself <laughs> the first thing i do is look the first thing I do is pray. After that, I look at my husband and make sure my kids are doing fine. That's all I do in the morning, like first thing. Yeah, and then get ready for work. What is the first time you are allowed to put makeup? Ooh. <laughs> I was allowed to put makeup when I was 18. 18, guys. Like my mom had no problem with it, but my sister, we have a very strict uh big sister she was really strict with us and i really thank her for that because if she wasn't that way i don't know maybe I, maybe i was gonna be messed up or something but um who who i am today because of her because every like she will pay attention to anything we do checking our phone and all that so putting makeup was one thing that was a no no to her life who are you to put makeup like you're just 15 you're just 16 17 why you want to put makeup so when i was 18 at least i'll try on a lipstick you know and all that till when i grew up till when i was 19 20 and all that so i'll develop myself but when i was 18 that's when i put my makeup <laughs> what language besides your native language would you like to to be influenced with what language? Oh. oh, let's see. French. Like, I love French so much. Like, I can trade anything for French, guys. I don't know. And my husband can speak French really good. Like, he's so influent, but he, he won't teach me. When we were dating and all, they promised to teach me French, but when they're like, oh, well, okay, let me, like, it, when I remind him, that's when he's going to tell me a word in French. That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, but French, that's my, one of my favorite languages I would like to learn. 
what country would you like to travel like your favorite country you like to travel france of course guys did i just tell you that i like french so france <laughs> yes uh, friends so how many siblings do you have oh <laughs> okay i am from a family of 10 no 11 i'm sorry 11 that means i have 10 siblings we are six girls and five brothers so we are 11 of us that's a lot same mom same daddy you all so we are 11 of us uh, next question is let me see what did you do for your for your last birthday well my husband took me out and eat to eat so that's the only thing i plus i was pregnant i was so tired i was uh i was eight months pregnant so i didn't feel like having any party or anything so my husband just took me out to eat and we came home to sleep plus it was too cold you also i didn't have time for parties what did you want to be when you grew up a journalist that's what i wanted to be so when i came to the u.s you all, i went to school and started taking class like one semester and when i was doing research and all that i found out that jobs are not easy to get as a journalist so i had to change my major and right now like i quit I'm in school major. well i was at school like i have one and a half year more to go but then I had to quit when I was getting ready for my wedding. Well, while preparing for my wedding, I was going to school. But then I had to quit because it was just too much. Preparing for the wedding, going to school, taking classes, homework. Yes. Guys, I couldn't do it. I really couldn't. So I had to quit my classes. And what major were you doing? I was taking... My major is, is medical coding. That's what I'm doing. Are you planning to go back to school? Of course, yes. Like my husband want me to do that so bad because he's so educated like crazy. So he want me to go back to school and do it and go finish my masters or whatever. But I'm, I'm, I'm not. I don't think I'm ready to do that. But I have to. Yeah, cause I need that damn good job, yo. Uh, next question. What makes you proud of your father? Oh my God. If I start talking about that, about my dad, this video is going to be long. But I'm a proud daughter when it comes to my dad. He's a really good man. A really good man. He's patient with everything in life. It doesn't matter. Like, he's patient with everything in life. And he just, he just has a heart of people. Like, nothing bothers him. It's just it's just so weird like i mean i am a proud daughter to have such a father guys what makes you proud of your mother she's a strong woman like she is a strong woman and i don't know she gave birth to 11 children there's so much to be proud of her guys i can tell you that do you like going out yes i do like if you want me to go out Tell me you've gone shopping. <laughs> like seriously, if you want me to go out with you, just tell me, hey Serafine, do you mind going shopping with me? It doesn't matter, I'm not gonna buy a thing, but let's just go. I like seeing cool things. So guys, thank you so much for watching my video. If you like it, comment, subscribe, share, give it a thumbs up if you liked it, and See you on my next video. God bless you guys and I love you so much. Bye-bye guys.